Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. So, if you've watched this show for any length of time, you might have caught on that some of my favorite things to do is test out the bolt actions. How do we test that out? We go back to 100 yards and we just see what they can do. Well, for years, my 100 yard backstop has been these two stakes. This is actually probably version 3.0 or 4.0 and uh, a piece of rickety cardboard sitting out in the rain. So you can see all the staples and everything we've pulled out of this and yada, yada, yada. Always gets warped. It's a pain when we mow. Oh, I literally just broke that while we're filming here. It's a pain to move it when we got to mow around it. They're not straight. And all in all, just a pain to use. Well, today we're upgrading our target stands out at the range. Check it out. This is going to be sweet. Let me show you what we got. Let me pull this out and we'll go set them in the trash pile here. Well, yeah, we, we might need this for something else. We'll put them in the save pile. All right. So like I said, upgrading my target stand, which was two old rickety pieces of wood. This is called the Caldwell Ultimate Target Stand. Pretty cool. Takes a two by four, which is already pre-angled. So you can hang a piece of steel. We're gonna do that here in a minute. It also has slots for one by twos, which is how I'm gonna replace what I was doing before. One by twos straight up and down here. But two pieces for the side. I'm gonna sit here and show you how it goes together real quick. And then we are gonna test them out. So, like I said, comes with the centerpiece for your posts, two pieces of angle iron, pre-drilled, two stakes, stake it in the ground, keep it from falling over. Little Allen key that we're fixing to use here. And four of these little bolts, we're gonna put them in through here. These little brass fittings are threaded. So let me go ahead and get these started. Super easy to put this thing together. And we're gonna have a super upgrade from the way we were doing things. Get these all started. Then I'm gonna tighten them all down. And then I'll show you how we're gonna use it. I got a couple of these put together. While I'm up here on the bench, let me give you a good up close look. So the two by four slot in the middle there is angled that away. So that way you hang a, a pistol target on it, piece of steel or whatever. It's gonna deflect at the proper angle. And then those one by two slots are straight up and down. That's how we're gonna replace my old sticks there for the 100 yard mark. All right, so check it out. I got two of them set up. One with those one by twos. So I can put the targets up here on my cardboard. You can see I've already been using it today for some videos. That's some, that's a good group there. Two touching, more there, two touching. Stay tuned for those videos, but you see the target here with the one by twos. That's gonna be a whole lot better than the situation I had before with those old wood posts. Now we can move it. I can put it up at the end of the range day. We can get the mower around it. And this one, just to show you how we can get a two by four in there and it's angled that way using that target stand. Again, this is the Caldwell Ultimate Steel Target Stand. But tell you what, I think we need to break this piece of steel in here real quick. Hold on. Got the Taurus TX-22 with the Banish 22 on the end of there. One of the most fun plinkers to bring out to the range. Let's uh, see how we can do here with it. I'm gonna get the laser on there. Laser and a green dot. Oh man, jammed on me. This one normally doesn't jam. Might be time to clean it, huh? Actually, I think it's uh, me, the goober who loaded the mag, didn't load the mag that good. Try again here. Mm, 
Didn't load another one. Come on, man. There we go. Man, we're in our empty. But there you have it, guys. Super quick video showing you our target stand upgrade here today. The Caldwell Ultimate Steel Target Stand. These things are probably going to be out here at the range and lasting forever. Definitely an upgrade from what I was using. But hey, appreciate y'all watching. Let me know what you think about these babies. Pretty nifty. Use a two by four in the middle or the one by twos on the side. Appreciate y'all. We'll see y'all on the next one. Hoo -hoo.